Hey guys, Kevin here, back at the Oligarch store. I had just received this shipment from Delma Parfums. If some of you guys didn't know, we actually carried their original collection earlier last year, um, and now they've actually come out with a brand new collection with five fragrances in total. This one here that I'm about to do an unboxing for you guys is called Elixir de Amor. Now we have some of the new ones like Zaya over here in the green bottle and in the purple bottle we have Mamona, which have been two very, very big sellers. If you guys are in Melbourne, do come by. You'll have to try this house. Their new fragrances have been really, really popular. A lot of people have been loving them. Their fragrances now are at the $420 price range. Brand new bottles now, new packaging and everything. So we have four new scents plus a very uh, big favorite out of the original collection. So let's unbox this. Check out now just the stamp. I actually had the honor of meeting Elmar himself and his wife Angelica in Italy. This is Elmer's family crest, his family seal. Each fragrance does come with a different color and it is the matching color to the bottle. So this one here, the Elixir de Mor, has a red stamp on it. So the bottle inside is the red bottle if you're looking for it online. All right, start a little unboxing here. So we're gonna peel off the family crest, Elmer's stamp right here and you get to keep this which is pretty cool take a look at the box guys at the front of the box you see a beautiful embossed monogram print of elmar's family crest when i had a chat to elmar he said you know in fragrances you have the different levels of oil concentrations so you have eau de toilette eau de parfum parfum concentration and so he wanted to coin a new term in the industry. So starting with his own house here, he uses quintessence de parfum. So it's a very high level, highly concentrated perfume that he's created. This is a different packaging to the original collection for when they first came out. So there's new collection now, a really nice display box here. Oh, oh, look at that. Well, Elma actually told me that he considers these his babies, his creations. Boxed in here is his Baby, the Elixir de Mor. This one I am very familiar with. Um, some of you guys might be familiar with as well if you smelt the original Elixir de Mor from the first collection. So, you know what? I'm gonna go straight on skin here, guys. And of course, what you would expect from a luxurious perfume like this, they went all out on everything from the bottle, the packaging, the cap, the box, to even the sprayer. So. They've really gone with the best of the best top of the line sprays where you have a really nice smooth uh, even projection here. It's a very soft to the touch the sprayer is. You know, when you smell this, you really you can really see why it was the best seller in the original collection. And you can understand why Elma has um, carried it onto the new line. It's just a very, very refined. Um, sweet and spicy floral amber fragrance, highly complex. If you just jump online and take a look at the fragrance notes, you can see that it's, it's, it's laid with a bit of everything. Getting an opening of some saffron, some pink pepper, so that's the spice with a touch of bergamot. Not so citrusy, more of like a sweet spice. And you also have the, the fig leaves in the top, which is quite prominent. Um, but I would say the heart of this baby is where it really shines. You have Bulgarian rose in it, you've got jasmine, and the sweetness that you get. I will consider this fragrance as having quite a fruity and sweet heart. That comes from a raspberry. So I, mean, I think it's perfect that, Elma, you've colored the bottle this really sexy deep red here with this very majestic gold cap here. Although a bit more on the sweeter side and uh, sweet spicier side, Females can definitely pull it off, but also a guy who's looking for something to wear on a date night, the Elixir de Amor would be a fantastic choice. The perfumer for Elixir de Amor is Mark Buxton. He's the nose behind a lot of big names, a lot of big houses, some that you guys actually are familiar with, like House of Siage, whom we carry, and also Comme de Gasson. A lot of um, creations of his are also in the designer field as well. So like Burberry, Versace, he's done a lot of perfumes for those. You can see his experience behind a creation like this. We also have the rest of the collection as well. Well, I'm gonna just quickly bring them over for you to see. So we've got also 
the other two. So this completes the five fragrances in the new collection from Velma Parfums. And it is available at Oligarch for you guys to try. Do come in and try it. The Elixir I have worn and worn over the past couple of months already. And I can safely say that this has incredible projection, performs amazing on the skin. Um, you're getting from this, I'm getting seven, eight hours. And in the spring, summer, on the warmer days, I'm actually getting closer to 10 hours on it. And these new ones here, I can only imagine that they will perform just as well. I haven't had time to wear them all yet because we've just got them, but I will give them all a proper wear over the next few weeks and let you guys know. So if you are in Melbourne, do pop in to Oligarch, try the new range. You can also find them online for you guys who are in other cities. We are doing free express shipping on all orders here. So order it and you'll get it by the end of the week.